Hey, this is an important message. This is a, talking about how I lost eight pounds in seven days. Trust me, I did not think it was possible. So what I did for my New Year's resolution, I wanted to fast to get myself closer to God. And I just understand that fasting isn't about losing weight, it's about replacing something with a stronger desire to get close to God. So the time I was supposed to spend consuming food, preparing food, that freed up more time in my life to focus on the word, focus on meditation, prayer, and restoring my relationship with my wife. And as a byproduct, because we do serve an awesome God, I actually shed at eight pounds in like six or seven days. I was 233 pounds December 1st. Today, I mean, I was 233 pounds December, I mean, January 1st. Today is January 6th, and I am 225 pounds. Let me tell you what I did. It's not even hard. Anybody can do it. I did intermittent fasting. All right. I just jumped out there because I'm, I'm just I'm just a real guy to just jump out over the roof. So I did 16 and 8. So I fasted for 16 hours and had an eight hour eating window. Well, not had. I have. I'm still doing it for 21 days. What happened during the 16 hours, I would just consume water. Nothing else. Just water. But during that eight hour eating window, I would, I, I cut a couple things out of my diet. No fast food, no white bread, no sugar, no soda, no energy drinks, and no sweets. I cut them straight out of my diet, day one. So I would wake up, eat oatmeal, a little peanut butter, boiled eggs, something like that, a little starch. About 10 o'clock I have a snack. Then I would have a big meal at lunchtime because I had to cut off my eating window at one o'clock. 1 p.m. was the last time I would eat till 5 a.m. the next morning. 16, 8 intermittent fasting. And guess what it did? I shed 8 pounds between January 1st and January 8th. I'm super excited. I want somebody to join this challenge with me, man. If you're struggling with losing weight, and the craziest thing is I stopped going to the gym as much as I was prior to starting fasting. I started working out less and actually lost more weight and people gonna say oh you lost muscle nah <laughs> i lost some fat like my face got skinny look at a post from last week my stomach got skinny my gut trimmed down everything man look it's going that's poking out that's it sucked in that's poking out i'm a i'm a post like i i was ashamed of my belly people talking about i look pregnant walking around this jane i cut out alcohol i cut out weed because that weed gonna give you the munchies if you got a THC card, legal mar medical marijuana, I had to cut it out because it was giving me munchies. It was helping with some things, but it was separating me from the love of Christ. So I had to cut it out, and I was able to successfully shed eight pounds in seven days. Now, it's going to be a journey. I wasn't even going to share the weight loss journey, but it was so dynamic, I had to put it out here. So here you go. Look at the gut. That's the gut. We're going to see it trim down. I'm going to see what happens. I'm going to see what God going to do. I'm not fasting to lose weight, but if losing weight is a byproduct, hey, I'm all with it. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I give you the glory. So join me. You might not have to jump out there and do a 16-8. Do whatever you can do. I just consume water during my fasting period, and it's easy for me because I go to sleep. The time where I would be starving, feeding for some food, I'm actually sleeping in the bed. So I wake up, pray meditate read the word i wake up at 4 30 a.m all right pray meditate read the scripture or play the scripture on the phone then i'll prepare that little first little meal because my stomach be so tight i got to introduce food back to my system and i give god the praise give him the glory pray with my wife when she get up or before she go to sleep and just focusing on 2024 is going to be the year 2024 is going to be the year so many things going to happen 2024 is the year of the Lord's presence in your life. He already in mine. I'm trying to get him in yours. What you going to do? Come on, join me. I'm going to keep posting about this. I'm, a, I'm about to go ham. Matter of fact, I'm going to put the scale on here. I'm going to put the weight off the scale on here and everything because y'all might not believe me. So y'all stay heavily motivated. Stay humble. Sit down. Don't forget to believe in yourself. Peace.